Manchester United consider Alejandro Ganacho e untouchable e amid interest from Barcelona and Juventus. Fabrizio Romano has provided an update contrary to reports on Thomas Tuchel possibly taking over from Eric Ten Hag as Manchester United manager. Paul Pogba's ban has been reduced from three years to 18 months. The midfielder is set to return to football in March 2025. Man United will rekindle talks with Champions League winner if Eric Ten Hag is sacked. Without further ado, let's dive into today's Not News. Manchester United have sent a strong message regarding their stance on Alejandro Ganacho, branding the Argentine winger e untouchable e amid growing interest from European giants Barcelona and Juventus. The 19-year-old has shown immense potential, becoming a fan favourite at Old Trafford with his dazzling performances and crucial contributions. Both Barcelona and Juventus have reportedly been monitoring Ganacho closely, viewing him as a future star. However, Manchester United see him as a central part of their long-term plans and are unwilling to entertain any offers for the youngster, regardless of the potential bids that could come their way. Ganacho's commitment to the club was solidified when he signed a new long-term contract earlier this year, further emphasising the fate the club has in him. Shifting attention to the managerial front, Renowned journalist Fabrizio Romano has stepped in to debunk recent rumours surrounding the future of Manchester United manager Eric Ten Hag. There has been speculation suggesting that Bayern Munich's Thomas Tuchel could be in line to replace Ten Hag should the Dutchman face the sack. Romano has clarified that there is no truth to these claims, and Manchester United's hierarchy remains supportive of Ten Hag despite the team's inconsistent form this season. The club is focused on navigating through this challenging period and no immediate managerial changes are being considered. Ten Hag, who guided the Red Devils to Champions League qualification last season, still has the backing of the board, although the pressure continues to mount. In a separate story, former Manchester United midfielder Paul Pogba has seen his four-year doping ban reduced to 18 months following an appeal. A French international, who tested positive for testosterone earlier this year, was initially handed a lengthy suspension that would have effectively ended his career at the top level. However, the reduction in his ban means Pogba will be eligible to return to football in March 2025. This news will likely be a relief for the player, who has faced an incredibly turbulent few years since leaving Manchester United for Juventus in 2022. Pogba will now have the opportunity to rehabilitate his career, though his future in football remains uncertain given his age and the challenges posed by the long layoff. In the midst of the growing uncertainty around Eric Ten Hag's future, Manchester United are rumoured to be exploring contingency plans should they decide to part ways with their current manager. According to reports, the club is prepared to rekindle talks with a former Champions League winning manager if Ten Hag is sacked. While the identity of the potential replacement has not been confirmed, this move signals that the club is keeping its options open as they assess the ongoing situation. Ten Hag's position remains safe for the time being, but with United struggling for consistency, this story could gain traction depending on results in the coming weeks. And that wraps up today's breakdown of the latest developments surrounding Manchester United. With Garnacho off the market, Pogba's return on the horizon, and managerial speculation continuing to swirl, there's no shortage of intrigue around Old Trafford. Stay tuned as these stories unfold and shape the direction of the Red Devils' season.